The 732 and 8th and Spring are both going to be 24-story towers that'll be mixed-use, residential, retail with parking. We are responsible for the superstructure of the project. People don't look at a concrete structure and think that that, that structure is moving. From the moment you pour it uh, to the, after the time you stress the post-tension cables to after you strip the reshores, there is a slight movement that happens. The decision to bring laser scanning into uh, some of our current projects was an important decision. We settled in on the ferro scanner. The 732 and 8th and Spring projects are the first where we've used it on every single deck from the ground up. What we're doing is getting very, very detailed as-built documentation of all the different stages that the deck is going through. We will go and we will scan a deck before it's even placed. So the main purpose is to actually scan the objects within, um, such as embeds and PT cables. Then we will do a scan immediately after the deck is placed that will show the initial finished product. We can test for the flatness and the levelness. After that, we will do a post-stress scan after the post-tensioning cables are stressed because the tensions that, that the deck undergoes can change the elevation a little bit. And then ultimately, after all of the shores are removed and the deck is basically a finished product, we'll do an additional scan. For processing the data, we use Pharaoh's program called Scene. And that is a program that actually takes the individual scans that have been taken in the field and ties them together. From there, we use the rhythm applications, which are called Builder and Inspector, and with those we're able to produce a deliverable. When it comes to FF and FL testing, um, we're contractually obligated to provide a certain level of FF and FL for these projects, but the Ferro scanner can also check the flatness and using the inspector app. What it does is it sees the elevation of all the points along the area you select and it's able to determine um, what the FF and FL is for that area you designate. I think that at this point, uh, nobody has questioned that it has been well worth the investment. Ha having laser scanning in-house here at Largo does position us very well for the future. I see the future of laser scanning being uh, a tremendous opportunity for not just us as a company, but for the concrete industry to get better at everything we do. The technology is far too powerful to go unnoticed and at some point it's going to be everywhere.